Hey, what's up, guys? I've been apologizing a lot lately um, for not uploading, and it's because of school. I'm not gonna lie. I mean, work is work, but school has just been midterms and homework and nonstop studying. So right now, I'm gonna be sh I, the reason why I didn't upload a video last Friday is because everything that I did on my car ended up being a fail. I plastic dipped my uh, trim. Um, thing it didn't it didn't work out. I'll show you guys in a little bit, and then I. Uh, Worked on my brakes, there were some problems, some screws weren't opening up, couldn't find the right stores for the right uh, hex nuts and everything, so it was a pain. And then I started uh, just, just working around the car, uh, weather stripping, couldn't put it back on the car. The, I got like a flat tire, battery died, like everything just happened to my car, and I don't have time to fix it because I have work almost full time. And then, you know, on top of that, you know, I did have spring break, that's why I did everything, but a lot of things also failed. Um, so I'm going to show you guys the car, show you guys uh, what stuff I ordered as well. I'm ordering, I have a lot of things going on for the car. I'm going to show you guys um, what things, uh, I I don't know, I'm thinking about going M3, uh, you know, full conversion with the engine one day or um, and make my own M3, but um, you know, I mean, I always still, I still want to get an M3. One of my dream cars is an M3, One of my main dream car is an Audi R8, but and M3 is in my uh, goals in the future. So I was thinking with this car, might as well make it so unique that, you know, when I go down to cars, car shows, stance meets, whatever, that, you know, it's, it's gonna be a nice car. It's not a common car. I don't wanna have a car that everyone has and I put a lot of money into it and not many people like look at it. So I ran into this website called Hard, um, Hard Tuning, something like that, Hard, I don't know what's it called. I'll put the link in the description. Um, and they have wide body kits for the E90 sedans. Now, there's a lot of wide body kits for uh, E92s, the coupes, for roughly around 500 bucks. But I found some for the E90. It's around $1,000, not the cheapest, but it actually makes the E90 look nice. Now, I have a guy that already put it on his car. I'll be putting a picture somewhere over here, somewhere, I don't know, somewhere on the screen. Um, it looks really good, I like it. Uh, and I'm wrapping my car, so I was thinking about ordering those the wide body kit wrap it and put it on my car while I'm still wrapping my car. I don't know. Again, I'm putting too much things out there. You guys don't know what's going on. Let me just take you to the garage. Alright guys, so we are now in the garage. So if you guys look at my car, I did add, let me see if I can get it in here. I did add the new M3, uh, well not M3, the m -Tech bumper. I put in the sensor holes and everything. It's just missing the diffuser. Let's see if I can focus it in, make it look a little bit better. So that is the bumper, I love the bumper. It's missing the diffuser, obviously. Uh, I'm trying to make it dual exhaust. Let, let me know what you guys think. So I, I plan on doing a dual exhaust. I plan on wrapping the car. So I picked out the color that I want to wrap my car, and I'm doing it myself. I'm gonna be showing you guys how to take off every single piece on your car and wrap it the right way for basically a first time. I'm doing everything myself. This car, I want it to be done by hand, everything by me. So, I'm gonna wrap it myself. I'm not gonna have somebody else wrap my car and, you know, it, it just doesn't feel the same. So, you know, all the hard work, the money. You know, you work for that money and then you pay somebody else to work on your car. I just, in some cases, I will do that, but in other cases, if I can do it and I can try to do it, I will do it. Right now, if you guys haven't noticed, I do have my new brakes. So, new brakes, new rotors. I love the way it looks. The drill rotors make it look a lot more sporty. Um, and obviously, they do have it, like you know, performance-wise, it would better braking power. And for the fronts, um, less brake dust. Because if you guys have an E90, I'm sure you guys know there's a lot of brake dust. If you guys are wondering about what kind of brakes and brake pads I use, um, just let me know that in the comments. Now for the rears, um, the rear tire is like. I don't know what's wrong with it. It's just out. It's just completely out. The rear tire is like, as you can tell, it's like touching the ground. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's flat. That's why I got a flat tire like the other day. Um, so I'm gonna have to go see what's going on with that. Um, we'll, we'll, I'll let you guys know. Now the other problem was me peeling this off. So I took off the weather stripping, which is underneath this. As you can tell on this window, it's gone. I took it off so I can paint it, like paint it off the car. Now usually with weather stripping, you can peel it off, put it back on if the car is somewhat new. This is an 06, so when you take it off, it's kind of rusty and it's kind of moldy that, and it, it, it starts to bend. And once it bends, it's really hard to put back. I put the rear one back because there isn't a side mirror. It's pretty easy. But I mean, it's not easy at all. It was just easier, but it was a, it's still really hard. 
So I put the rear one back on. I'm probably gonna have to take it back off because um, I'm gonna end up wrapping it. So if you guys know, you need to remove the, tr the side um, weather stripping to wrap it. So I got the color shifting Reptide wrap. It's from Avery. Um, I love the wrap. Uh, I don't think many people have that wrap, especially not on BMWs. And a lot of the parts you take off of BMW is very difficult, so we're gonna see how this is gonna work out. Hopefully it works out pretty good. I'm gonna do it myself yet again. And uh, so I'm breathing pretty hard. I just went down to Walmart, got myself some jumper kit cables, about to get my car running because I heard it's really bad for your car if it just sits, you know, battery dead and everything. I don't know. Better safe than sorry. So I gotta boost, get my car jacked up, ready to go before I go off to work on my other car. And then, yeah. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Um, I'm probably gonna be vinyl wrapping or installing the diffuser or probably ordering the wide body kit. So stay tuned. A lot of great videos coming up. And yeah, appreciate you guys. Please drop a like and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take it easy. Cảm ơn các bạn đã theo dõi. Các bạn hãy bấm like, comment và hãy bấm đăng ký để ủng hộ cho kênh mình nha. 